Hey everyone, Wanderer here. Welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. This is my original series that I played through on this character. The uh, the original, uh, not on hardcore, the hardcore playthrough, the save was corrupted, it's been lost. There's not much I can do about that. Uh, I really disliked playing this game through the monastery portion. I got really frustrated and bored with it and I ended up quitting because I hate it so much. I've decided to uh, just kind of go around that quest. Basically, I'm going to do sort of the evil and much quicker option to get the quest done because I'd like to get that quest done and get on with the rest of the game. So, um, let me get over to the monastery here. It's at nighttime, so we're going to sneak inside and we are going to kill Pius and steal his lucky die, his lucky dice, because that is what is required of us for the... Um, the bandits or whatever. We have to steal that dice because this guy knows about them, so we have to silence him effectively to get in good with them. So that is what we are going to do. We're going to sneak in. Should not be too difficult. I'm going to go ahead and take off all my armor here so I'm much more sneaky. I'm very noisy right now, so only one noise is good. That's what we want. Very low noise here. So we're going to sneak into the monastery. I know how to get in here. It's not particularly difficult. I don't think you can go in either this way or the other way, but Henry is real sneaky, so I don't... This Henry is anyway. He's pretty sneaky. I don't think we'll have any issue getting in. I guess that would have worked, too. All right, so this is actually trespassing here. But again, I don't think we'll have any issues. It's not even locked. It's just open. Maybe I unlocked them earlier. But yeah, not a problem. Make sure nobody's over here. Uh, looks like we are good to go. And this is actually inside the monastery here. So now that we're inside, we're going to go upstairs to the, um, like where they sleep at. And we're going to kill Pius, which I feel a little bit bad about. I mean, he did do some bad stuff. He's like reformed himself and wants to start over again here. You have a couple options, I guess, whenever you finish the quest. You can either turn him into the bailiff, uh, who probably would execute him or imprison him. Or you can set him free. Um, or you can just kill him yourself, either way. I don't think it matters too much which way you go. So, basically, I'm just going to go for the easiest option here. Here we go. This should be dormitories. So, we're going to look for him and uh, stealth kill him. Let me make sure I... Do I have a dagger on me? Crap, I, I don't. Is there one on my horse? Oh, thank God. Okay, yeah, let's move that over. Uh, with the dagger, we can do a stealth kill. I'm pretty sure I have that. Let me look under stealth here. Yes, we have stealth kill, so I can kill Pius without waking anyone else, hopefully. That's the plan anyway. So let's find him here. Of course, you wouldn't know this. Yeah, here we go. You wouldn't know this unless, you know, you'd already been through here and stuff. So, eh, I don't know. It's a little bit, I don't know, dishonest maybe or something. But, man, I just, I just want this to be done. Do I have any, um... Schnapps, yeah, let's move the schnapps over. Get a save here real quick. It'll make us extra stealthy as well. And yeah, let's do a stealth kill. And nobody is the wiser. They're going to be very, very um, disturbed when they wake up and find out that Pius is dead. This quest star, the die is cast. Okay, grow, go to the agreed place in the swamp by Sasau. And that is, uh, okay, right here is Sasau. The swamp by Sasau. Ah, uh, it's over here. Okay, so uh, can I just fast travel? I can't go out of here. Okay, that's fine. We, we got to sneak back out of here. And then we're going to fast travel over. I think I'm just going to skip over to where I'm actually back over there where we're supposed to meet with these bandits 
and then getting good with them, and then they'll take us into their confidence. But that's the, uh, that's how to skip the entire annoying monastery area. I feel a tiny bit bad, but you know, it's just a video game, guys. Anyway, I'm gonna get out of here, and uh, I will see you guys once we're over talking to the bandits. Alright guys, so we are just about there, I think, going towards the agreed-upon place by the Sasau Swamp. This looks like the place they were talking about. Alright, light a fire as a signal for the bandits. Alright, so that is over here. Right over here, I suppose. Yep, here we go. Darn bandits making me kill people. Henry feels bad. Might not be the best idea to take a nap, Henry. Waited all night, huh? Morning, sunshine. Hope we didn't wake you. Kurva. Did you have to sneak up on me like thieves? We are thieves. Besides, we had to make sure you weren't followed. Or trying to lead us into a trap. But enough of this chit chat. Let's get down to business. We heard there was some trouble at the monastery. Question is, was it the right sort? Did you do that job we agreed? Do you think I'd be sitting here if I didn't do it? How should I know? The world's full of idiots. It's done. You've got proof? He had this on him. Hmm. Aye, that says all right. What did you do with the body? I left it where it was. What else could I do? So, they lose a monk and find a corpse. How long do you reckon it'll take them to put two and two together? Well, it's not like I was planning to make a career in Rome. Hmm, <laughs> fair enough. Soon it won't matter anyway. What now? What now? You did your job. Welcome. We need people like you. But what do you need people like me to do? <laughs> I'm just a crimp. All I do is recruit. Now you get to go to our camp and find out everything you need to know. Where? Are you seriously telling me you didn't notice the camp? Not too observant, are you? Well, there's a hill above Sasau, And on top, there's an old abandoned fort. <laughs> Only it's not as abandoned as it used to be. That's where the camp is. Go there and report to a fellow by the name of Eric. Tell him Kozliak sent you. And they'll let me in just like that? Good point. I almost forgot. At the gate, show them the special die you took off Pius. That's our sign. That's all? That's all. You'll learn everything you need to know at Vranik. And hurry up. I've got a feeling there's something being planned. Okay, so we're going to Vranik and find out about the plans. Um, we should be all good to go. I need to go and report to Sir Radzig and Sir Hanush on the investigations. Is that optional or do I have to? Okay, it's optional. I can go and report to them. Or I can just go straight to Vranik and find out the foes' numbers and plans. I need to go back and uh, sell stuff at Ratai and do some bartering and stuff. Some repairing and whatnot is there as well, so... I think I'm gonna probably do that stuff off camera, and then we'll go and talk to uh, Sir Radzig and Hanush. All right, let's deliver the bad news to Sir Radzig and Hanush. Sir, I have news, and I'm sorry to say it's nothing good. After everything that's happened, you have even worse news. That's almost impressive. I'm afraid so. It's going to happen again, and on an even bigger scale. You're full of good cheer, aren't you? What exactly will happen? It seems the Pribislavitz encampment was just the start, and they're far from defeated. 
How did you find out? I found a recruiting agent who worked for them and let him recruit me. Ah, God's holy hat. You never cease to surprise me, lad. And what did you find out? They have another much bigger encampment in Vranik near to Sasau. What do those bastards want? And who the hell are they? To hurt us? Conquer the region? I'm not sure yet, but I can find out. How? I'm one of them now. I have their secret sign. I know where their camp is. All I have to do is go and take a look. That's out of the question. It's too risky. Sire, compared to everything I went through to get this, it will be child's play. I already passed their test. They trust me. Then we'll have to attack them before things get out of hand. Ideally, right now, when they're not expecting us. Once we catch that mangy little shit, we can ask him nicely what he wants. But then again, before we attack, it would be useful to have a spy go and scout out how many of them there are and what they're up to. I don't want you to take any unnecessary risks. It's much less risky than our raid on Pribislavitz. All right then, Hal. Go there and find out how many of them there are and what their plans are, whatever you can. But don't stick your neck out too far. Yes, sir. Godspeed, lad. Okay, so now we have to go to Vrenik and go and scout the area, I suppose. So, um, again, going to be a bit of a ride over there. That's over by Sasau, so I suppose we will... Hmm, I have no idea how to get in there, really. It's up on the hill on top of Sasau, they said. There is a uh, road, it looks like, kind of going from... Maybe from over here, up this way. I'm going to kind of probably skip it unless I find anything interesting on, on the way and I probably will see you guys once we are at Vrenik. Well guys we've barely made it out of Ratai and we've got an attack on the road. I could avoid it but uh, I quite enjoy the combat. Let, let's do this. Uh, there's quite a few of the soldiers here. There's actually there, there's a lot of them. Holy crap. Um, I'm just gonna shut up now and do my best to try and not die. I haven't saved for a while. Nope, we got knocked off. That's fine. Get up, Henry, get up. I don't bother. Then I don't. I can talk to him. Ah, finish him off. No use begging. Nah. No mercy for these guys. Alright, well that was a fun diversion, I guess that's all. I'm gonna loot stuff real quick and then we'll be on our way. Okay, this is the Vranic Wood. Well, it wasn't easy, guys, but I got up here. 
Let's see if we can get to the very top of the mountain here. I think we can. And uh, oh, this is just some stones. Let's keep going. Looks like we're getting towards the very top. I did have to... Oh, suddenly it's raining. I did have to just kind of go back and forth my way up here. That rain kind of almost makes me sick to my stomach. Yeah, so if we keep going this way, I think we're on the correct path now. We ought to be able to hook up with the road over there, and we'll actually be able to get to where we're supposed yeah. to go. This looks promising. There are uh, some torches, so yeah, that, that looks promising. Oh, we got a fast travel point, too. Okay. Yeah. That could be it. Do, do you think so, Henry? Do you think so? I'm pretty sure it is. Let's go ahead and get a save in here as well. Entering Vranek Hilfert can abort some quests in progress. Okay, good thing we saved. And it, it did actually go through, right? Uh-oh. Don't freeze on me, game. There we go. Uh, yeah, it's a save. Okay, cool. What do you want? Let me inside. Inside, eh? What's the password then? I came here for a game. Show me that. Aye. All right. Welcome to Vranik, comrade. Thank you for your kind welcome, comrade. Who should I report to? Eric. He should be in the house, at the top. That was easy. I don't want to, I'll be. Fucking boring. Okay, scout out the enemy camp and forces. No one to, I'll be. Fucking boring. How goes it? Not bad. I've only been here a few days, but I ain't complaining. Food, booze, and good company. Well, company. Hey, I'm new here. Can you tell me what's going on? Just what it looks like. Boozing. What else is there to do? Some stupid fuckers trained to keep up their fighting form. But why bother? With this kind of force, we'll go through any opposition like a knife through butter. I got a piss. Have you heard anything about what we'll be doing next? Of course. Early tomorrow morning, there'll be a big sortie. Everyone around here knows that. How did you end up here, anyway? Me? You're a bit green around the gills, aren't you? Me? I'm right at home here, see? Whenever the lords are fighting each other, you'll find me and my trusty sword on one side or the other. Whichever pays best. Okay, well, there's a big fight coming tomorrow morning, it sounds like. Let's go Let's go and see if we can find Eric. Doing, fighting, never losing, robbing fucking whores and boozing. Take the women, burn the village, drink and annihilate and pillage. Burning, wrecking, making strife, how sweet it is a robber's life. Awesome song, man, awesome song. Can I just... Oh, nothing in here. I say, can I just steal this shit? Apparently not. Killing, fighting, never losing, robbing fucking whores and boozing. Take the women, burn the village, drink and iron legs and pillage. Burning, wrecking, making strife, how sweet it is a robber's life. Those tents look pretty impressive. These fellows aren't paupers, that's for sure. That's true, they're all geared quite well. Not only strong outer walls, but inner ones too. This isn't good news. Wonder why there are so many bandits here. What's the deal? Fuck, I'm almost sober again. Killing birds of blood and a blood in the 
All right, let's go up the inner walls and go talk to Eric. This must be where the commanders are. Bees. Like it's the first time you got them. You must be used to itching by now. I'll never get used to this. Try washing yourself once in a while. You wash yourself. My granddad's brother drowned bathing in a pond. I'm not taking the risk. I only wash when it's raining. Be chasing the women away with a stick. You bet. They can smell a true man. Is this the place? Yeah, this is the place for sure. What do you want? Kozlik sent me. Ah, more reinforcements. You're the one from the monastery? Yes, sir. So you really killed that turncoat? Yes, sir. Well done. I heard about you, and quite honestly, I didn't think you'd succeed. So can you handle a sword? Yes, I know what I'm doing. Well, I think it's best if we put you to the test. Go to our combat master, Vanyek. He'll soon find out what you're made of. Just go downhill, as far as the stockade. His tent is right next to the training arena. All right, sir. Okay, gotta go and fight a guy, I guess. They are properly organized. That's for sure. So, tent next to the combat arena. This guy right here, maybe. Come on, Henry, get over it. Yeah, here we go. Are you Combat Master Vanyak? <laughs> Aye, that's me. What do you want? I'm Henry. Eric said you'd try me out to see how good I am with a sword. Ah, another greenhorn. Nice to see Kozlik's doing his job. Mind you, most of the peasants he sends me couldn't fight a pile of manure with a pitchfork. Hey! Don't I know you from somewhere? You this familiar. is the guy that trained us initially. Yeah, um... Uh... Yes, you taught me sword fighting in Scalis. Wait now. Yes, I do remember. We met at the alehouse. Well, I'm glad you made it out alive. I took to my heels before it even started. All right, let's see what you're good for. Have you got a weapon? If not, you can borrow one over there. Now, are you ready? Let's do it. Ready as I'll ever be. All right. Let's see what you're made of. Hey! Shoo! Where are you God going? I thought you wanted to fight. What? 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 <laughs> A dirty cheat. I do not like this helmet much at all, I have to admit. You won't last long. Jesus, you got me. You're a lot better than most of the fuckers here, lad. Well done. I've had a bit of practice. So I see. I'll tell Eric what you've got in you, don't worry about that. But so you don't think old Vanyak is past it, I'll teach you one trick you'll be glad to know. Oh, that's very generous of you. Well, I don't want to take it to the grave with me. All right, listen. Before you start twisting and turning, Take a good firm stance with your legs wide apart, like this. As if you're about to let off a huge fart. I think I've got it. Thanks. Is he, is he gonna like kick me in the nuts or something? Oh. What, what did he teach me? Okay. Let's go back and see Eric again. Sir, may I... What is it? I went to the fight master as you ordered, and I... What's the matter? Lost your tongue? I knew he was dirty. I think I know what's troubling the unmaster. 
He's surprised to see me here. And the feeling's mutual. When did you start recruiting Radzik's people, Eric? Radzik? Indeed. This boy is very dear to him. And I expect he's looking for this? Am I the right, sword. You bastard. Ah. Damn it. He's coming round. I apologize for the discomfort, but it's for your own safety. And ours, of course. You can count yourself lucky, lad. I'm gonna keep you alive. I'm sure your father will pay a nice fat ransom for you. My father's dead. That lucky of yours wouldn't even let me bury him. He doesn't know, Eric. Nobody told him. They told me, a foreigner, but not him. How very inconsiderate. I'm sure you'd rather hear it under different circumstances and from someone else, boy. But beggars can't be choosers. Your father, your real father, is alive. You even know him. It's your liege lord, Radzik Kobela. Although, how much can he really care about you? Here you are, a homeless orphan, and he still hasn't acknowledged you. Your parents are both dead, aren't they? I thought so. And yet, Radzig still hasn't told you the truth. Could it be that he's ashamed of you? Hmm. I wonder if you'll want to pay that ransom after all. Well, best not think about that. If your father won't pay your ransom, you have no value to me. My father's dead! I understand why you feel that way. My own childhood was not dissimilar. How strange that we should have something in common. But I've delayed long enough. Now it's time for you to tell me why you came here. I was looking for my father's sword. Which was stolen by a certain bastard. <laughs> and I found it. But I wonder which father you mean. In a way, it belongs to both. It doesn't matter who it belongs to. I'm going to kill you with it. Ah! You're hardly in a position to threaten me. But now I think of it, why not? When your father, your real father, pays, I'll give you an opportunity to try. I think that's very generous of you. Isn't it? <laughs> Radzik will crush you. And I'll be there to see it. I very much doubt it. You spied in our camp. You must realize that your father hasn't a fraction of the forces I've gathered. And now, with the king in captivity, there's no one to levy troops to come to your aid. <sighs> Even united with Hanush and Divish, your father couldn't raise more men than I have. The only force in this country capable of defeating me is Sigismund's. And he pays me. When he wins, I win. Everything I take now will be mine. And I plan to take everything. So meet the new lord of the realm. A man like you will never rule here. Ugh. Have you never heard of Lord Sokol of Lamberg? Or Sahinek, the dry devil? They fought for your king and plundered the estates of the lords in Austria, just as I'm doing here. Like they say, the stronger dog fucks the bitches. And war is a nasty business. Sir, it's time. Now, I'm afraid I have more important business to attend to. I'll leave Udo here to keep you company. And let's hope for both our sakes that your father pays up. Farewell. Rotten hell! <laughs> Knock some manners into him, Udo. Come on, Eric, let's go. We've got work to do. <laughs> Henry, why'd you take your helmet off, man? Henry. Henry. Wake up. Can you hear me? Jesus, that brute really worked you over. Here. This is, uh... Try to drink. One of our friends. Yeah. Matthias? And Scalettes. 
thought you'd never come round. How do you know my name? Don't you recognize me? Zbyshek. Zbyshek. Oh, Zbyshek. Holy shit. You fucking traitor. You throw me to those bastards and then look me in the eye like nothing happened. Shh. Shh. Quiet. Maybe we started off on the wrong foot. But I'm your only chance to get out of here alive. So do you want my help or not? Hopefully we get our gear back, man. What do you want? I want to get you out of here. But if you'd rather, I can leave you to rot and get the shit kicked out of you by Istvan's bruiser. And why are you helping me? Why would you, of all people, want to get me out of here? I've got my reasons. If not for the good of my soul, then for the good of my purse. It'll cost you a few groschen, and that's all you need to worry about. You shouldn't look a gift horse in the mouth. Shouldn't I? Even when it comes from a treacherous bastard who set his cutthroat friends on me when I was trying to bury my parents. I won't deny we didn't get off to a very good start. But this is a chance to start over and let bygones be bygones. Why are you even here? Why don't you escape yourself? Why don't you go on your own? What would I do? I've been left alone in this world and I'm an outlaw. How long do you think it'll take before I'm swinging from a gibbet? I need to get some coin and get the hell out of here. Right, and delivering me to Sir Radzig will help with that. So why do you want to help me, really? So what exactly are your reasons? Nothing you need to care about. Let's just say it's a personal matter. Let's see. We have to trust each other. Look, it's true we didn't get off to a good start. But if you expect me to trust you, you'll have to trust me too. Not a day passes without these cutthroats pulling daggers on each other. And I'm the youngest, so they make a slave out of me. <laughs> a bandit's life isn't quite how you imagined it, eh? My heart bleeds. But you could easily make a run for it on your own. Why bother with me? Look, I just want to live a normal life. For that, I need peace and some coin. You need to get out of here, and you've got coin. My help won't cost you a tenth of what Istvan would want from Sir Ratzik. Why shouldn't we help each other? wonder how much he actually wants, then. Um, where's my stuff? What about my possessions? Eric has your things. It would be suicide to try and get to them. Forget them. Oh, wonderful. So I'm supposed to make a run for it like this? It'd be better if you wore something to blend in, it's true. But I can't go and get you anything. I'm supposed to be guarding you. So if I leave my post, I'll have to avoid the others just the same as you. Alright, what's your plan? How do you propose to do it? Finally, we're getting somewhere. I know a way you can get out of the fortress without anyone seeing you. I'll untie you, and you'll have to make your own way there. It shouldn't be hard at this time of night. I'll wait for you outside. Afterwards, you'll tell your noble father I helped you so they don't hang me. And naturally, you'll pay me something for the risk I'm taking. Risk? Sounds riskier for me than for you. Not really. What are they going to do with you if they catch you? They want to ransom you, so the worst they'll do is lock you up again. But me, who was supposed to be guarding you and let you escape... Nobody's going to pay no ransom for me, friend. Okay, let's go then. All right then, let's get out of here. Untie me. That's what I want to hear. But first, swear you'll tell Sir Ratzik I helped you. And that you'll pay me too. You have my word. What's the plan? All right, I'll have to trust your man of honor. Now listen, I found a place where you can easily get out. Down in the camp, on the slope above Sasau, there's a place where they throw the waste over the wall. The pile of shit reaches almost to the top of the stockade. All we have to do is jump over and we'll have a soft landing. Then we're free. Free and covered in shit. So that's all? Well, first, we both have to get there. We can't let anyone see either of us. I'm supposed to be guarding you and you're... Well, I'm supposed to be guarding you. So we have to keep to the shadows. And stay away from prying eyes. I'll go first. There shouldn't be anyone outside in front of the barn. When you're out, go left along by the wall. There are cliffs 
everywhere. So try not to get yourself killed. I'll wait for you not far from the camp, by the dead tree between the path and the brook. Good luck. Oh, God. Um, do I have anything? Like, I can't even save, can I? And we're half half beaten here as well. I'd really like to get my stuff back. Um, you know, we are Henry. We're really sneaky. It might be possible. Eric has my stuff, and Eric is uh, right over here. I don't have any lockpicks, though. Although... Save your schnapps? Okay, that's good. We can at least get a save in. What, uh, what's... Oh, hold on, let me just go again. Let me just go ahead and just use this, I think. What does this do? Nighthawk. Vision improved. Okay, but see better than the dark. That's cool. Marigold decoction as well. Get ourselves healed up here. As best we can, anyway. Well, if I snuck up on that guy, maybe I could knock him out and take his stuff. Might be a start. It's gonna be tough, though. In fact, I have to climb a ladder and go up behind him. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Okay. Well, we got a dagger at least. We got decent armor and stuff here. Okay. So we can do a stealth kill at the very least. Did we get any keys or anything? We have a lockpick. That's what matters. We got a lockpick from him. So one lockpick. That could make all the difference. God, Henry, did you really have to make that noise? It was not that far, man. I could have jumped that myself, I think. Okay, here is where Eric is at. I think we can get in here and take this guy out. And if not, we can just kill him. Probably. I'm not great with a mace, but, I mean, probably will be okay. There's a guard. Let's wait for him. Be careful. Well, there's a big old chest here. It's not here. Maybe this one? No, some decent stuff here. But not what I'm looking for. What is this? Eric's trunk keys, uh, that would have been nice to have. Wait, what is this? Why does it say... Unlock there? Huh. God damn it.
That's very odd that it says unlock. He said it was with Eric. I have to assume it's right here. No, it's definitely not right here. Okay, guys, so I had to reload, and this time when I went to open this thing, it was, in fact, locked properly. So when I opened it, all my stuff was there. I, I'm not sure what happened the first time, but whatever, man, it's here now. I had to kill, like, five or six guys to get a lock pick to actually get in here this time when I reloaded. Um... But I did get everything. Let me get Henry properly outfitted. Now I'm I have all this stuff from all these guys I killed here. Um let me go ahead and put all my proper armor here. Actually, uh this is a really nice curious, apparently. I think it's better than what I was wearing before, so you know, gotten a little little upgrade there. This one's actually better for now, but I think once this is repaired, let me actually repair stuff real quick. I'm not going to use this anymore because I hate having my vision obscured. And there's a mod for that. Maybe I'll switch to that mod in a bit here. But yeah, I'm not a big fan of having uh, the visor. Is there a button to put your visor up? Like, can you have it up by default? I might look into that and see if I can change that. Okay, put that on. Put those on. Getting the best stuff I possibly can here on. All right, well, you know what? Uh, I'm going to save again because I want to make sure that I don't lose my progress that I've gotten after uh, getting my stuff back, because it didn't work previously. Didn't get my stuff back previously. So, uh, okay, so we're supposed to get out now. Um, I completely forget what he said, where we're supposed to go. Let me see, is it the marker on the map? Oh yeah, it's over here. Yeah, so you're supposed to go out and then to the left and then sneak along the wall, I think they said, and then jump from over here onto the pile of shit is what we're supposed to do. So maybe I'll try to go to the left up here and then see if we can get out that way. Um, I could probably just... You didn't hear anything up there, dude. I could who's there? probably... Oh. Hey, okay. who's there? I was going to say I could probably sneak up on this guy and just kill him, but... Um... Thing is, if I if I fail on the stealth kill or anything, I'll have to um, have to fight him, and that's not ideal. Though maybe if I go along the edge over here, I can just go around him through the bushes over here. There are people over here too. Yeah, I don't know about this. Ramp. I don't want to get stuck. I may hey, just end up fighting, fighting my way out, guys. Yeah, you're telling me. Up, oh, drop it. Someone just shoot at me. Okay, hold on. I've got to actually my controller for this. What 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 a nice spot to uh, have paused there. Okay, first off, we've got a um, someone shooting us with an arrow over here. Bow and arrow. They need to be taken out asap. The answer to my prayers. Just when I'm here. Hey, it's Bernard again. You must be here somewhere. You. <laughs> you got the best you can do. Come here, Lily Liver. 
You'll get what for. I'll slaughter you. Show what you're made of. I hate this. I keep getting stuck in uh, the animations for the deadlock here. And I want to attack again. There we go. Bring it on! Come here, Lily Liver! Like there, it was a double. I did not want to do a double there. Back on weak at the knees, have you? Boy, yell! I'll wring your neck, you cur! Fucking hell! Why am I stuck in this? God. You that combat? Switch, switch, switch. What's going on? I'll slaughter you. Who's there? What's that? Hey, the answer to my I'm going to enjoy this. Yeah. Are you now? You gonna enjoy it? Are you enjoying it? Anybody else? Oh, you too. You want to fight Henry too? Okay. What's going Let's on? just kill the whole camp. What have we got here? Entertainment? Great. I'll slaughter you. <clears throat> Bryce, you got. I can't get a lock on you. There, lock onto him, Henry. There you go. You're gonna get your bow out, huh? Give up. What's going yeah. on there? Where is my sword at? Who's there? Why? Why is my sword gone? I'm pretty sure I don't have a sword. Look at this. I don't have a sword. What's the matter? Come on. What the hell happened to my sword? Why is there? Get your, get your sword out! Oh my god! Oh my god! Stop! Hear me! Stop! I give up! God! What for? Hey! Who's there? Gone weak. Okay, I think I got him. Think you're weak in the knees, asshole. Asshole, ah. die. Ah. Ah. What's going on then? What does it look like going on? Killing the whole camp. The guys done what pissed me that? off. What's that? What's that? Well, I Who's there? <laughs> Oh, nope. Drop, drop him. Don't pick him up. I'm trying to kill him, man. You pull that What's up? Shake yourself? No, no. Is that all you've got? Uh, 
Gone weak at the knees, have you? <laughs> Bernard, what are you doing here? <laughs> Who else? Goddamn bandits. There's no strafing in this, and I keep forgetting. These guys just keep spawning, like, forever. Well, I never. The pig mm. turns up wood. Yeah. Oh, shit. Ah. Bring it on. Fuck. Ah. What? Ah. What's the matter? Ah. 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 God damn it. Too far away. You're dead. Where are you going? I I don't think uh I don't think tents work like that, man. I think I regen health whenever I kill someone because of my perks, so, uh, I can pretty much go indefinitely. My god. Is, is that it? Is that all? Okay, how, how close am I? <laughs> I'm, like, on the other side of the camp. I'm just murdering my way through the camp, but this way I can just go out the front door, man. Oh my god. Okay. Let's, uh, let's see what's of value on you. Not really much of anything, honestly. There's a U bow. I might take that, so I just, just so I have a bow. Your stuff kind of sucks, though. I'm not gonna lie. All right, uh, cool. Let's see if we can get out of here now. We're supposed to sneak out of here. I'm tempted to just walk out the goddamn front door like a badass. This is not, like, that far of a drop, you know? I'm just, just saying, like... Where did they, they dump the shit over here somewhere? Yeah, right here. Oh, okay, I have to actually use it. That's, like, not even that far, man. Like, you could... There's no need... Uh, well, I mean, there's a hole there, which is important, but... All right, uh, we're going to go and meet with Zabizhek. I already got my equipment back, so I don't know what that is about. It's still there. We've got to go over here, though, and meet with him. Um, let's, uh, doesn't matter, I guess. Can I get my horse back now? Your horse can't get here. Of course not. My horse is, like, right outside the thing, though. Like, he's, yeah, left him right outside the front gate. This is a really steep, uh, incline here. Can I just, like, fast travel? Okay, you can't fast travel right now. Gotcha. Well, let's put a torch on this so we can at least see, make our way down. I did bring a torch, right? Oh, yeah, I have uh, I have nine. Let's drop some of those torches. No wonder I'm so over-encumbered. Drop all but, like, one of those torches. God, don't fall to your death now, Henry. Like, you just... Oh, God. Huh, apparently I left something important in the possession of a corpse. All right, so I have to go back to the presbytery to get that. I don't... Oh, maybe I killed someone important, I guess, and didn't realize it. I was over there. We can put away our sword now. Is it Zabizhek? So, we're out. Now it's time for you to keep your part of the bargain. Uh, yeah, whatever. Deal's a deal. Don't worry, I keep my word. But I have to go to Ratai and see my... my father. They took my coin when they captured me. Fine. We should get out of here as quick as we can, anyway. Well, you'll have to help me. 
Somehow the massage I got from that big bastard didn't do me a lot of good. I don't suppose you have a horse hidden around here. A horse? <laughs> Actually, I didn't think of that. Any word about your boy, Radzig? Nothing yet. Well, let's hope he hasn't done anything rash. Wouldn't surprise me, given the balls that he has. Now, I wonder where he might have got those from. Don't start, Hanush. I'm sorry, sir. This fellow... Henry! Father? <laughs> I told you he had balls. Well, I see that you haven't been idle, and we'll certainly need to have a talk later, but not quite so publicly. It looks like you have plenty to tell us. What happened? I, uh... I got a bit tied up at Vranik. But now I know what they're planning. What's being planned? And who's planning it? Spit it out, boy! There's no longer any doubt about it. It's that Hungarian noble you were hosting on the same day Sigismund pillaged Skalitz. Sir Istvan Toth. Toth and his people. Everything fits. They're the ones making the counterfeit money and using it to hire mercenaries from all around. He's already got quite an army at Vranjik. But what the fuck is he after? I can tell you exactly. And you won't like it. How's that? I had quite a long talk with him. What? When I was trying to get into his camp, I was taken captive. We had a bit of a chat. Actually, he told me his entire plan. What? I suppose he thought he didn't need to keep it secret any longer. I'm not all that surprised. Why not? What's that bastard planning? He's in the service of Sigismund. He wants to destroy King Wenceslas' allies. That means us. He's gathered a very large force. I'm honestly not sure if we can defeat them. And he knows no one will come to our aid now. That fucking cunt! I'll skin him alive! How many men has he got? More than a hundred, I'd say. And how secure is their camp? It's an old abandoned fortress on a hill above Sassau. It's inaccessible from three sides, surrounded by a timber palisade. Bastard! I'll crush that rabble of his! That's easy to say, old friend. It seems Toth isn't taking any chances. Together with Dibish, we can muster enough men. And we can all see there's no time to waste. That bastard wants a battle? Much better we pick a time and place than he does. Undoubtedly. We have to take them by surprise. It would be best to attack tomorrow night. We can't get ready any sooner. <laughs> That's what I like to hear, Radzig. Henry, I want you to get yourself fixed up and then go straight to Sir Dibish of Talmberg. Tell him to assemble all the able-bodied men he can and bring them to Vranik tomorrow evening. We'll wait for him there. Yes, sir. Finally, a chance to show I'm not carrying a sword just for ornament. What is it, Henry? Is there something else? The thing is, we have to deal with Zbyshek. I see. And who is he? Oh, we can, we can tell him to hang. All right, yeah, he deserves a reward. He saved my life. Zbyshek is from Skalitz. He helped me escape captivity and save my life. I promised him a reward for it. Indeed. Well, Spishek, if you saved my son's life, I'm grateful to you. As a token of my gratitude, please accept this reward. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your generosity. And under the circumstances, we won't ask how you came to be with that herd of swine at Vranik. So you'd better get out of here quick before I start thinking about it. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Goodbye, my lords. Thanks, Henry. God be with you. Get a good meal inside you and get those wounds tended to. You look wretched. And if you need equipment or armor, tell Bernard. He'll give you what you need. Yes, my lord. No more, my lord. I'm your father. 
I swear, Hal, I plan to tell you. I'm sorry Ishvan, of all people, beat me to it. But now we have more urgent matters to deal with, hmm? Later we'll have time to talk about it. What do you say? As you wish, my lord. Father. Good. Now go to Divish as quickly as you can, son. So we are indeed the son of Radzig. We can go and get some, I guess, some free armor from, uh... Okay, cool, we got our horse back. We can go and get some free armor from Bernard, which I think we will, because why not? It's free, right? I'm gonna go ahead and drop off all the spare stuff here. But I think, guys, that's gonna be all for this episode, so... Thank you so much for watching. I hope you are enjoying watching this series again. I do plan to finish it. I think we are not too far from the end now. So, um... Hey! Who's there? Who's there? I'm... I'm just... It's, it's my chest. It's... It's all, it's all my stuff. What are you guys getting all upset about? Anyways, see you guys next time.